So AI avatars are getting scary good now. Check out this quick example. Hey guys, it's Ryan Dozer here. Be sure to join my AI Marketing Insiders community. This is a no BS community for marketers, content creators, and business owners. So of course, join my community. But no, in this video, I'm gonna be talking about some of these major updates that we're seeing inside HeyGen that are taking AI avatars to another level. So be sure to stick around for the entire video. And if this happens to be your first time to the channel, welcome, my name is Ryan, and my mission is to help marketers and content creators navigate the overwhelming world of artificial intelligence. And if you wanna know my favorite AI tools and prompts that I use for marketing and content creation, be sure to get my free AI marketing essentials guide. You can find the link for this free guide in the video description or pinned comment below. So first of all, for those unfamiliar with HeyGen, this is a popular AI video generator best known for its AI avatars. So whether that be public or you can create your own avatar right here, so you'll see all the public avatars that they have available that you can use. And you can also create your own video clone. And by the way, I have a whole separate tutorial showing you how to create your own video clone that looks and sounds exactly like you. I'll leave that and everything else that I mentioned in the video description below. And if you head over to my YouTube channel, shorts on my channel and start watching most of these videos, this is my clone created with HeyGen. So this tool is extremely powerful and I'm using it all the time. And when it comes to accessing HeyGen, this platform is completely free to get started. All you need to do is sign up for a free account, but I will say on the free plan, you are extremely limited in the features that you get. You only get three videos per month. You get low video processing. You have a watermark on every video. So if you're serious about wanting to dive in and creating AI avatars or an AI clone of yourself, I'd recommend starting with the creator plan for $29 a month. Give that a try for one month. If you don't like it, just go ahead and cancel it. I'm not even sponsored or affiliated with HeyGen. I wish they had an affiliate program. Maybe they do, I'm not sure. But I will leave a link to their general pricing page in the video description below so you can check it out for yourself. So in terms of updates, the first thing to note is that HeyGen has officially updated to Avatar version four. They have a quick little demo video here on their X account talking about this. And I'll leave a link to this in the video description below if you wanna check it out. Now within HeyGen, if you click on the home screen under video tools here, right from the home menu, you should see an option that says photo to video with Avatar 4. And this is the major update. Now there are some other updates that they did come out with that I'm gonna share with you here shortly inside the labs where they're testing various things with AI avatars. But the most notable update is photo to video with Avatar 4. So now I'm gonna walk you through step-by-step -step how to use this. So of course, from the HeyGen home screen, I'm gonna go ahead and click this photo to video with Avatar 4. Now, what you wanna do here is you can try one of these sample photos if you just wanna do this for the first time and test it out, or you can upload your own. But very important distinction here. They say for best results, choose a photo that's at least 720p with a clear view of the face. The more high quality and centered of a headshot that you can provide it, the better results that you're gonna get. So I'm gonna go ahead and upload a photo here as an example. I'm just gonna do this professional headshot that I have on my desktop. And here we can give it a script. Now you can use ChatGPT to help you with the script if you wanna do that. But in this example, I'm just gonna do Hey guys, my name is Ryan Dozer and welcome to my YouTube channel. Be sure to like and subscribe. Of course, right? So I'm just gonna do that as an example. Now you can select your voice. So when you click select voice, you can choose all the different voice clones that HeyGen has at its disposal in the HeyGen library, or I have my voices. So right here, I have a Ryan Dozer AI voice clone. And what you'll notice is this is from Eleven Labs. I have a whole separate tutorial explaining this process on how I created this professional voice clone. I'm gonna go ahead and click that. You'll see I have it hearted. So I'm gonna go ahead and click that. And this will use my professional voice clone. So now I'm gonna go ahead and click generate video. Actually, before I do that, I wanna say you can actually change from portrait or landscape. Uh, but for this instance, let's go ahead and do portrait and then I'm gonna click generate video. And while it's doing that, I'm actually gonna do one more. That way I can generate another video while this is running in the background. So I'm gonna skip ahead and wait till this is done here. Okay, so while this is generating, I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna go ahead and click home, 
photo to video with Avatar 4. I'm gonna click upload. And in this instance, I'm actually going to upload the YouTube thumbnail that you're gonna see for this video. I have it ready to go. And so now what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna see if this, this what this is gonna work for the face in this thumbnail. I'm gonna say, um, hey guys, check out my YouTube video about Hey Jen, I'm just gonna do something simple. I'm gonna use my Ryan Dozer voice clone. Let's do landscape this time and click generate video. And then I'm gonna skip ahead and wait till these two videos are complete. All right, so after about 30 to 60 seconds, these videos are completed inside my projects. So let's look at this first one really quickly. It's only about five seconds, so I'm gonna click play. Hey guys, my name is Ryan Dozer and welcome to my YouTube channel. Be sure to like and subscribe. Not bad, a little creepy though with that smile towards the end. Now let's see what this other one looks like, I'm curious. Hey guys, check out my YouTube video about Hey Jen. That one was super odd. It even had the faces inside the uh, phone here in the thumbnail talk as well. But if you go to my X account, I actually had several examples showing different headshots. Here's another one here. Here's another casual headshot. So I'm gonna play that one really quickly to show you what this looks like. I was actually more impressed with these outputs. Hey guys, it's Ryan Dozer. Be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me for the latest and greatest in the world of artificial intelligence. I cover chat GPT, Claude. So the mouth movement's a little off, but in terms of how it sounds, I mean, it sounds realistic. It sounds exactly like me. Now, another use case here is I was on a podcast. So the guy who runs the podcast had a promotional graphic. So I threw that in here. So let's see what this hey sounds guys, like. Hey guys, be sure to check out this podcast episode. I was recently on for Isaac Jarnigan's podcast, now available on all platforms, so be sure to listen. Yeah, again, the ending's a little cringeworthy there too, but I'm just showing you some examples here and getting the juices flowing of what you guys can do for this new Hey Gen update of this photo to video with Avatar 4. And again, if you're on the free plan, I think you can use this, don't quote me on that, but I would recommend being on that creator plan. That way you can get access to all of these features with unlimited videos, no watermark, etc. Now the next update that's worth noting inside HeyGen is this URL to video option where you can literally drop a URL to your product listing or instantly generate promo video content with a Shopify store, maybe an e-commerce page, et cetera. Now to access this, you need to click labs on the bottom left. And these are the different AI projects that HeyGen is testing. They call it their labs, similar to Google labs where they're testing Notebook LM and all their AI products. And so within labs, we see URL to video. Now I don't have an e-commerce store, so I'm not gonna, and the process takes very long. I was trying this earlier, so I'm not gonna run through an example in this video. I'd recommend you guys try your own e-commerce store, but what you can do is just view some of these community videos first. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on one of these. Let's do this Dr. Seuss one, and let's see what this looks like here. Embarking on a new journey, unsure of where life will take you, look no further than Dr. Seuss's Oh, the Places You'll Go. This timeless class, Let's look at one more here, a more business real world use case. Fam, raise your glasses, cause we've got a brew worth celebrating. Corona Extra Beer. This imported gem from Mexico has been perfecting the game since 1925. So a little distracting, but again, that is all AI avatars. I mean, there was no actual video editor in that process here. And there's, again, it is in lab, so it's in beta mode. So it has a long way to go, but this feature seems to be very promising where you literally just drop in a URL of an e-commerce product page. And then with your avatar or a community avatar, they can generate promo videos. So quite powerful what Hey Jen is doing there. Now the next update I wanna let you know about HeyGen is this translate of video. I don't think this is necessarily brand new, but with the HeyGen version four, this feature just got a lot better. So if we click translate a video from the home screen, you have two options here. You can upload a video from your desktop or we can use a video URL through YouTube or Google Drive. So I actually just did a quick video in this example. I'm gonna go ahead and find it here on my desktop. There it is right there. And now what I can do, and first of all, you can add a brand voice if you wanna do that. Don't translate, force translation. There's all these different parameters you can set, but just for simplicity purposes, I'm gonna go ahead and click create new translation. So what you can do is original language. You can leave it on auto detect, or obviously mine is in English. I'm gonna leave it on auto detect and let HeyGen figure it out. Now for language, I'm gonna go ahead and do Spanish. 
Now auto detect, so obviously it's one. I'm gonna try that. Uh, for brand voice, just leave it as is. And then for these, enable dynamic duration. Uh, you don't want that. So you have to be on creator mode for this one. There's some advanced options you could do here. I'm just gonna click submit for translation. And then what I'm going to do is I'm gonna skip ahead and wait till this video is complete. All right, so now the video is complete, but first I'm gonna show you what the original video sounds like. Hey guys, my name is Ryan Dozer and welcome to my YouTube channel. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe and I appreciate you being here and I hope you enjoy the next video. So what I did is I uploaded this and I translated it to Spanish. So now let's see what this updated video looks like with the translation. Hola chicos, mi nombre es Ryan Dozer y bienvenidos a mi canal de YouTube. No olviden darle like, compartir y suscribirse. Les agradezco que estén aquí y espero que disfruten el próximo video. So those of you watching who might speak Spanish, let me know in the comments below if that was even relatively close, because I have no idea. Uh, now, I did try to get another one here in German, but this one is taking a while. But long story short, that is a feature that I wanted to show you guys, is the ability to now translate that Hey Gen version for Avatar. Now the next update worth noting are what are called UGC or user generated content avatars. UGC is a huge niche right now in organic social media content creation for various brands around the world. And to access this, all you need to do is click avatars on the left menu and then under public avatars, you should see UGC right here. So go ahead and click that. And you'll see there are tons of different UGC avatars now available. So I'm gonna play a few of these so you guys can see how realistic some of these look. So let's go ahead and play Marcel first and see what Marcel sounds like. He even has different looks here, different outfits. So we'll try Marcel standing in a coffee shop. Welcome to the new era of video creation with HeyGen. Simply type your script to get started. And then of course we could go in here and then type our script. So if I click portrait, we wanted this optimized for TikTok, YouTube shorts, Instagram reels. We could come in here, click script. We could go ahead and upload a script if we wanted to upload audio, or we could start typing something right there. But I'm gonna go ahead and exit this part of it. And then let's go back to the UGC avatars. Let's try one of the female ones here as an example. I'm curious to see what this sounds like. So let's go ahead and do Gabriella. She only has one look, but let's see what she sounds like. Welcome to the new era of video creation with HeyGen. Simply type your script to get started. Now the voice seems a little off, but obviously I'm in the weeds of this. And if someone just randomly saw this pop up on their phone via TikTok or YouTube shorts, they might not catch on to it. But you guys see where this is going with AI avatar UGC content. There's this whole debate now where is AI going to destroy UGC? Well, this might be one of the catalysts of that as a lot of these avatars look extremely realistic, including my own clone that I could technically use for UGC content as well. So that's another update that I wanted to show you are UGC avatars from HeyGen version four. Now inside the lab section here, another update that I wanna show you is this video podcast. So you can do the, and I already made one here on the bottom and I'm gonna show you that as an example here shortly, but what you can do, you can literally drop in a website link or a PDF. And so in this example, I just did the Bitcoin white paper PDF. And so I went ahead and downloaded this and then I uploaded it inside HeyGen. Now, obviously Notebook LM kind of blew up for the AI generated podcast world, but it was always those two default voices of the man and the woman. You can add those sources and it would generate a podcast based on your sources. So this is a similar idea here, but we can use our own avatars or the avatars created by HeyGen. So I went ahead and already made one and I uploaded the PDF of the Bitcoin white paper. You could drop in a URL to summarize the text idea here. You would click next step and then fill out a few more things. And what would happen is that you would get a podcast that looks like this. So in this example, I actually used two of my AI avatars to talk to each other. And this is very interesting to look at. And the avatar on the right looks a little fidgety, so it definitely looks off. But the one on the left looks pretty good. So if you have two really high quality avatar looks, this can be extremely powerful. So I'm gonna play a little bit of this so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So we're diving into this pioneering peer-to-peer -peer electronic cash system that um, completely rethinks online transactions without relying on banks. It's all built on digital signatures and a clever proof-of-work mechanism.
right? It's fascinating how the design removes the need for a trusted third party, which tradition. So the voice is a little off, even though it's using my voice clone. And this one on the right, obviously, it just looks off, right? But that's just a very quick example. And again, this is in lab. So it's still in beta mode as they're fine tuning this out. But let's look at the demo podcast example that HeyGen used. So let's look at this really quick. You know, I've been thinking um, about how APIs are really uh, shaking up business these days. They are. Oh, yeah? In what way? Well, it's like they're not just for tech teams anymore, you know? Yeah. They're becoming powerful drivers of growth. Cut your eye. So... Hey Jen has this sweet. So not bad, right? You guys get the idea of where this stuff is going that we can now use AI avatars to make dual podcasts just like this. So another unique feature that Hey Jen has in the background. Now, the last new HeyGen feature I want to explore in this video is also inside their labs on the left menu. This is called Interactive Avatar. So I'm going to go ahead and click this. This is where I can actually communicate with an AI avatar in real time. You'll notice all the examples here that they already have. L&D compliance training, interviewer, customer support therapist, doctor's assistant, and I'm sure they'll add more of these over time. Now I could go ahead and create an interactive avatar if I wanted to do that. So that's super unique, but for the purposes of this example, and you can add a knowledge base if you wanna do that, an integration guide, but for the purposes of this example, I'm gonna go ahead and click one of these examples here and start interacting with it. So let's go ahead and click uh, June, the interviewer. So you'd click chat with June, and then I would click chat now. So let's see what happens. All right, so it looks like it works. Hi, I'm June from the HR team at HeyGen. We focus on empowering creativity through visual storytelling. I'm eager to hear about your technical journey and what excites you about joining our innovative engineering team. Hi, June, how are you? How's it going today? Hi, I'm doing well, thank you for asking. It's a great day for conducting interviews and connecting with candidates. How about you? How can I assist you today? Yeah, it is a great day. I guess, how can I land this dream job? I wanna make a lot of money and just have the best job possible at your company. What should I do? I'm glad to hear you're excited about the opportunity at HeyGen. To increase your chances of landing your dream job here, consider the following tips. One, tailor your resume. Make sure your resume- So I'm gonna go ahead and click end chat. I don't wanna do this and take up a 30 minute more of this video. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and click yes, it was helpful. Now, I noticed I only had 10 minutes worth of time there. So there was a time cap on these interactive avatars. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and X out of this and then go back to the interactive avatar screen. I'm gonna click labs, interactive avatar. But you guys see where this is going with all of this. And this is just super cool that we can now chat with someone who I guess is a subject matter expert in all of these different platforms here versus just talking to an AI bot like we can on Google's AI Studio studio with the stream real time feature. So again, I'm, I'll be very curious to see where HeyGen is going with these interactive avatar examples, public avatar, and also the ability to create your own interactive avatar. So those are some of the updates going on at HeyGen, and I hope you guys can now see how this technology of AI avatars is continuing to get better and better. I only scratched the surface too. There are all these other features within HeyGen that I didn't cover as I didn't wanna make this a 30 to 60 minute video. I just went over what I thought were the most important updates and features. But if you've made it this far into the video, I truly appreciate you. Be sure to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you found value, but let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Are you a user of HeyGen? Are you going to try it? Do you have your own AI video clone? Really want to hear what you guys have to say in the comments. But most importantly, I hope you all have a great day.